Hello Wooden Tots. So today I wanted to show you how we could make a number matching game. Um, I don't have any toy cars, so here I've got some lovely old vehicles. And what I'm going to do is use some tape, something that will come off easily. I've got some electrical tape here, marking tape will do. Um, a pen to write our numbers on. And I'm using a piece of paper, but there's no reason why you couldn't draw out some road um, on some wooden floor or a tabletop um, with the tape and create your car park like that. So let me get started and I'll show you what we can do. Hello, wooden tots. Today I've got an idea for a fun number matching game that makes use of a toy vehicles you've got, some of your children's favourites maybe. Um, all you need is some tape, some scissors, um, a nice marker that will write on the tape. I've got electrical tape but masking tape is perfect. Often children make quite elaborate roads on our wooden floor at Wooden Tots. It's a much enjoyed activity and it's something that you can extend on a tabletop or your kitchen floor. It's perfect for that. So what I've done is I've written numbers one to four. That's all the vehicles I have, but I'm sure that your children might want to count further on. You might have more vehicles. You can even do this with matching letters as well. I've got my numbered car park spaces and now all I need to do is put the numbers on our vehicles. Right, we're all set. I've randomly shuffled these and you can get the children to shuffle them around, drive them around. And I might start by prompting them, what's the first number? Do you recognise the first number? Quite often our children are quite secure with these, but maybe they need some prompting. We can help them count on their fingers. One, one, this is number one. We drove the number one car in. And after one is... They still might be finding it a bit tricky if they're still early to their counting and recognising symbols. So we can help them count again. One, two. This is number two. Yes, this is number two. Can you find the number two car? And so on. Another fun way of um, adapting this game is putting the letters of their name onto each vehicle in order and getting them to drive them in to, to build their name up. Um, you could extend this all the way to 20 and beyond. It's great if they've got some older siblings to help along the way, even writing out the numbers. Um, some of our older wooden tots are very good writing out their symbols, so they might like to get really involved in the making of this too. I hope you enjoyed this activity. Take care, everybody.